What's happening around the world? It's time for another serving of news bites. 最近国内外发生哪些大事？午餐搭配 ISRT News Bites， 慢慢的一口接一口，吸收最新时事和趣闻。Hello, everybody, and welcome to a new episode of News Bites. I'm Trevor Tordemasi, and I'm Nancy Sun. In today's news, no more styrofoam cups for Taiwan. Things get more expensive, and Marcel makes a movie. All that and more coming up next. Top of Taiwan, Taiwan 禁止保利龙杯 No more styrofoam cups for Taiwan. If you forget your reusable Huan Bao Bei cups at home, it may be time to change that. Starting from July 1st, Taiwan's Environmental Protection Agency will not allow stores to use single-use polystyrene or styrofoam Bao Li Long cups anymore. This means you'll probably need a reusable cup when you buy drinks from coffee shops and tea shops. From places like Family Mart or Seven Eleven, or even at fast food supermarkets, stores, and supermarkets. Polystyrene or styrofoam is one of the most popular plastics in the world. You're more familiar with polystyrene in its styrofoam form. That's right. Polystyrene is basically styrofoam. It is formed when its molecules, fenzi, connect together to become a long chain, fenzi. A German inventor discovered polystyrene during the 1930s, but it wasn't officially invented until 1941. Companies like using it for packaging because polystyrene is very flexible, 有弹性的 But polystyrene is bad for the environment because it is very, very difficult to recycle. Hui Shou and companies like making polystyrene more than they like reusing or recycling it. To recycle what is known as food grade 食品级 polystyrene, the food from containers has to be washed off first before it is dried. Then it is ground into something called fluff. Fluff is melted and then turned into threads made with polystyrene. That means only 12% of polystyrene gets recycled in the end. This 代表只有百分之十二的保利龙最终被回收 Because polystyrene cannot pollute our air or our water, some people think polystyrene is not so bad. But the bad part is, most of the polystyrene that people make ends up in the ocean. Fish and other animals could die if they eat the polystyrene. This means, like banning 禁止 the use of plastic straws, banning polystyrene could be the only way to keep this type of plastic out of our environment. And that will protect not only Taiwan's fish, but also other animals that might live near the water too. Going global. Why are things more expensive? Why are things more expensive? If you go to the market with someone from your family, like your grandparents, parents, or uncle and aunt, you might hear them complaining. You might hear them say, "Why is everything so expensive?" It's because of something called inflation, 通货膨胀 That's when the price of something goes up, and that means you can buy less with the money you have. For example, when your candy bar used to cost thirty NT and it now costs thirty-three NT, that's inflation. When the price of your favorite snack goes from twenty NT to twenty-five NT, that's inflation too. Inflation is when things become so expensive that you cannot buy as many things with the money you earn. Inflation can happen for many, many reasons. Sometimes the materials 原料 used to make something become more expensive, and sometimes the cost of gasoline, which is used to bring things from one place to another, becomes more expensive. And sometimes rent, 租金 which is the money a shopkeeper, 店主人 needs to pay someone who owns the building, can get more expensive. If rent goes up, prices go up too. 
The problem with inflation is that when things become more expensive, you can buy fewer things with your money. 通货膨胀的问题是，东西变贵了，所以钱能买到的东西就更少了。Inflation might sound like a very bad thing, but that's not always the case. Sometimes it is a sign that many people are earning money, so they can buy more things. And if everyone is working, that can be a good thing. Today's feature. Marcel 有自己的电影了 Marcel makes a movie. Marcel is the name of a shell with one eye and a pair of sneakers. My cousin fell asleep in a pocket, and that's why I don't like the saying "everything comes out of the wash." He isn't real, of course. He was created using a special kind of movie-making technique, 制片技术 called stop-motion animation. Marcel has always lived on YouTube, but he's getting his own real movie for the first time this year. I'm making like a little documentary. Oh, it's like it's a like... movie, but nobody has any lines, and nobody even knows what it is while they're making it.、Mm. No.、Mm -hmm. The movie deals with Marcel's loneliness as he looks for a way to reunite with family and friends. 这部电影谈论的是马赛尔的寂寞，他找办法跟亲戚好友再次团圆。Marcel the shell with shoes on will be in movie theaters in time for the summer vacation. The recap. So in today's news bites, if you forget your reusable cups at home, it may be time to change that. Starting from July first, Taiwan's Environmental Protection Agency will not allow stores to use single-use polystyrene or styrofoam cups anymore. And have you heard your parents or grandparents complain that things are more expensive? That's because of inflation. Inflation means that you can now buy less with the money that you have. And Marcel the Shell with no shoes on is a YouTube star who is about to make his first movie. Marcel's movie is about a shell who is looking for his lost family and friends. The movie is coming out this summer. And that's today's episode of News Bites. This week. We want you to have your say about food. There's a saying in English: "It's raining cats and dogs." It means it's raining really hard. But that idea of strange things raining down from the sky really makes you think, right? If the sky could rain food, what food would you like to have rain down? Record your message and send it to newsbites n e w s b i t e s at i c r t dot com dot t w with your name and age and if you'd like the name of your school. Make sure to send us your recording by Thursday at noon, and you might hear your message on our show on Friday. ICRT 与教育部国民及学前教育署，下次继续和您聊新闻。ICRT App 和网站也能重复收听。More local and international news next time on News Bites, brought to you by the K-12 Education Administration. Find past episodes available on the ICRT website and app.